top-ranked Alabama against the Volunteers of Tennessee. There seems to be some issue on the field. Yeah, there sure does. Might be a clock issue. Now remember, because the Tennessee headphones do not work, Alabama will probably have to the take Tennessee theirs off. Headsets are malfunctioning. Therefore, both teams will have to remove their headsets till the problem is fixed. If it is, though, if it becomes a problem, most of the first quarter, he would go down. Saw that. Two teams have returned kickoffs for touchdowns. Oh, he fair, fair caught it. Wow. Dennis Rogan is back to return it. Nice high, fairly deep. Rogan backs up, grabs it at the 21. Gets a good block. There's no flag on that block. And the return out near the 47-yard line. And in the secondary arenas, Baron Woodall and Kareem Jackson on third down. Nice pass, left side. Denarius Moore, number six. Hardesty caught and dropped by Javier Arenas. It's fourth down. Javier Arenas, who needs only 110 return yards to become the all-time leader in the SEC. Not going to get it here as he calls for the fair catch and takes it. McElroy back, steps up. Not known as a runner, but that's a pretty nifty move. And he might have enough for the first down. He does, out to the 31. First time in his career that Jones went without a reception. Here's a quick screen out to the left side. And a big hole. A first down at the 46. Guess who? On cue, Julio. Paul Rhodes, who was defensive coordinator down at Auburn a year ago. Yes, he was. Yep. Third down, McElroy. That's a little high, but Jones has it. Breaks the tackle, gets a first down. Four-man rush for Tennessee. McElroy backs up. Oh, you can't up throw that pass. And you can't throw that pass. Greg. You cannot dump it that quick. Nick said it's an NF the closest to an NFL game he's coached since he's been at Alabama. Now split backs. Crompton goes down the far sideline, has his man. This is Hardesty out of the backfield. That one looked ugly. Couple of flags and the ball on the ground. We'll check the laundry list. Dead ball, snap infraction, 69 offense, five yard penalty, still first down. Now the motion from Teague, play fake. Crompton, a lot of time. Goes deep, intercepted. Picked off by Mark Barron, who a week ago returned an interception, 77. I think the back might have done the right thing. Let's protect the quarterback first. Here's McElroy, left side, caught. Julio Jones, third catch here in the first quarter. All right, Tim, Wildcat. Mark Ingram will take the direct snap, we assume he does. Handoff, Richardson comes right. Spins, breaks two tackles, and that worked pretty well. It sure did. One of the more memorable drives of this year was last week against South Carolina when Ingram did this yep. for 68 yards. You know, Tennessee, Vern, excuse me, still two deep safeties against this Wildcat. I don't know if you can stop it with two deep safeties. Here's your answer. There's the space right there for Mark Ingram, right into the secondary. Clock in the back on the offense. Ten yard penalty from the spot of the foul still results in a first down. But golf was actually his first passion. He won the Midwest Junior Nationals twice, consistently broke 80, and guys, his best score is 69. Interference call as Jones was the intended receiver. Right side, Jones. Big part of the game in the early going after being blanked last week. I, I know you looked at a lot of film. I did. Tiffin's extra, uh, field goal is up. And it's good. 
And with that uh, successful three-pointer and the applause of Nick Saban, Lee Tiffin becomes the number two all-time scorer in Alabama history. Three up. That's Gerald Jones in motion, so an empty backfield on second and nine. Quick setup. Crompton has him open. It's Hardesty. The running back split wide to the left. And a huge gain to the 41. Second big catch he's made today. Backs in the eye. Brown weaves his way inside the 35. Bryce Brown is the running back. And he'll get the handoff and come right. Bangs his way down near the 30-yard line. It appears he'll have enough for the first down. Two wides to the right. Alabama's blitzing. Here comes Arenas inside. It's caught. This is Denarius Moore, and he's got a first and goal, Tennessee. Daniel Lincoln has only missed twice this year. This is a 24-yarder for the tie. Got it. Well, that was a very low trajectory. Let's watch out for that later. Lincoln did not get that ball up in the air at all. A lot can happen, of course, but boy, they're on a collision course right now. And here is the kick taken by Terry Grant, number 29, heads to the left of the field, gets a block from Huber. Still got a lot of opposition, and he's uh, out of bounds at the 45-yard line. McElroy, 6 of 13 so far. Drills it outside. It's Julio Jones. Yep. Marquise Mays in motion to the right. Pass is complete. Out on the right side. Catch made by Michael Williams, number 89. Everybody I was not going to say Everybody it. Everybody was. We had to do it. <laughs> Third and two. Oh, dear. <laughs> And here comes the rush, McElroy. Way short of the line lack, of scrimmage. Lack of confidence in your quarterback. And they will try the field goal from 50 yards away, officially 50. Tiffin, his career long back in 2008. That's very low. Very good, but it's good. <laughs> <laughs> Six return for touchdowns, as you can see, and a career average. This is almost a rugby style. He didn't yep. run to the right, but he didn't want to give Arenas any Absolutely. chance. Absolutely. That was by design. Here's your Wildcat. McElroy is wide to the right side, the quarterback, and Ingram takes the direct snap, skips through. This has been their best formation in the game. Yeah. Julio Jones. Ingram, easy first down, wow. out to 45. Now that was impressive by that Alabama offensive line that time. They just mashed him back. Look at all the coverage McElroy's getting out there. Here's Ingram. Savion Frazier makes the tackle, number 43. All right, McElroy in motion. Ingram. They're mashing them, aren't they? Yeah, they sure are. That pile, the pile is moving north at yes, the snap. Yes, it really is. And that was last year in the LSU game, but Alabama recovered. Here's the pass, and it's caught. Complete at the 40, another first down. This is Darius Hanks, number 15. And Trent Richardson is in. He's uh, split to the left. Well, if it's working, why not do it again? Wow, what a nice little spin move to the 35-yard line. And he's averaging six yards per carry in this one. McElroy back in with a play fake. A lot of time, but he better get rid of it. He does. And it's caught by the fullback, Baron Huber. And McElroy and Ingram both in the backfield here. Ingram stays in. Down the middle. Caught. Marquise Mays, number four. First down at the 11. And off. Sweet. Ingram. Out of bounds right at the five. Instead, they're going to settle for the attempt for three. K 
Kiffin's field goal is up and good. Boy, they just mashed them all the way down the field, and then they got fancy. Left side, Hardesty, Ontario, Hardesty. Tim and Spencer joined by Aaron Taylor in the studios today. Here's the uh, first down, or the second down gain out to the 40 yard line. On second and three, that was Hardesty again. Two receivers to the right side, one of whom now lines up in the slot. Crompton looks that direction, settles short for Gerald Jones, and uh, he gets the first down at the 47. Robbie Green and Mark Barron of the deep man now, the safeties. Here's Crompton, fires it. Oh, great throw. Yes, it was. Caught. That's, oh, another first down at the 34-yard line. Great throw. We're back at Brian Denny. Volunteers with a first down 10. Quick flip left side. Gerald Jones again. He does not get out of bounds. He gets to the 30-yard line to make it a 9-6 game at the break. Short. Short. I wonder if Julio Jones got a little tip on that. He was the guy jumping in the back. Tiffin will kick off. Oku and Richardson are the deep man. This is a short kick taken for 14. And a fine return out near the 28-yard line. That's New Keys Richardson. Oh, a big stop by Alabama. Three yep. and out to start the half. Cunningham. Another, another or, rugby. Yes, it was. Arena scoops it up at the 15. Bounces off a tackle. Now watch out. He's got a chance. There's a flag. I thought so. During the return, illegal block below the waist. Yes, that's ah. what happened. He threw himself at the wedge blockers. Dennis Rogan at the 10. In the end zone, touchback. Uh, not executed very well by the punt team. Gerald Jones is in the slot. The sweep comes to the, no, it's a bootleg, and Jones makes the catch. Nice play fake by Crompton as Jones crossed in motion. Quick flip out into the right side. Catch made by Marcellus Teague. Go for it. And get it. Yes. Got across the 45. It'll be first down. Tennessee. They'll come left this time. Cut inside. It's Hardesty. And Ontario Hardesty fights for nice game. Second and three. Nine three is the score. Left side, Bryce Brown. Mark Barron, number four, with the tackle. On average, Alabama gives up 63 per game. Here's Crompton into the flat. Caught. That's Austin Johnson, number 40, the fullback. They'll test the middle. And that will move the chains. The first down at the 31-yard line. Play fake. Pressure. Got him. Javier Arenas. They were waiting for it, weren't they? That was the game plan. It's the 22nd sack of the season for Alabama, but their first today, a loss of 12. Prior to the snap, play of game, offense, five yard penalty, still third down. Little swing pass, Hardesty comes left. Fourth down. Arenas, 20. Not near the 26th yard line. 
I mean, that's Belichick. There's only a few guys that can play defensive mastermind the way these guys can. Here's McElroy rolling out, fires it low. Julio Jones. Here's the keeper and appears to appears to have enough. See where the spot is. You got stone to begin that thing. I'm not so sure. No. I don't think so. Oh, there was two spots. One official had it not made to the top of the screen, right? This official to the top said he didn't make it. Not this time. Dennis Rogan, fair catch. Grabs it at the 20. 43 yard punt. Second down. Crompton with time. Jackson makes the tackle. The game is after the 27 yard line. Gerald Jones with another catch. Crompton quickly out to the right side. Caught by Marcellus Teague. Boy, this, you could not, if you knew the defense, you could not have made a better call. Crompton with a play fake. Again, he's got time. Finds his man. It's caught by Denarius Moore. And a huge gain for Tennessee. It could be that the play action passing game has come through for Tennessee. Hand off Bryce Brown being chased by Woodall. And then Nico Johnson is up. It'll be third down. And it looks like two in a moment. Right now, let's go back to Tim Brando in New York. The second surge to the left appears to have given Tennessee its first and ten. It's Bryce Brown. Nice step behind the line. There's a flag down. It's going to be third down. We'll see what the penalty might be. Well, we're, we're landing Holding. on the 69 offense. 10-yard penalty. Repeat second down. He's one of two today. Missed from 47. This one is from 43. the tight end Rogan with the tackle McElroy quarterback draw that's going to be another Alabama first down McElroy across the middle right into the umpire's midsection oh And as a result, Tiffin's going to try a 49-yard field goal on fourth and three. Whoa. That's twice today that he's just gotten it through. And it makes it a two-possession game. Yep. So Kiffin will punt it away. He opts to... Uh, Give Save, it up to Alabama. Saban saying defense safe. He's not even bringing his guys. Arenas will let this one bounce and roll inside the five. See, by not by going defense safe, keeping his defense up front, he didn't have two guys back there, and that cost him the 20 yards of the roll. And Jones comes in. They'll give it to Ingram. Squirts through. Huge play. 13 yard game. So Ed Orgeron talking with uh, Monty Kiffin on the sidelines, former head coach at Ole Miss. Here they come after him, and PJ Fitzgerald goes down, and that flag is going to cost Tennessee. <laughs> Personal foul, roughing the kicker, 19 of the defense. 15-yard penalty for the previous spot. Automatic first down. I think a 100-yard game is important for Ingram for the Heisman talk. 
Well, he uh, picked up a few right there. There's a fumble yeah, the ball and a loose down. ball. Never fumbled He's before. never lost a fumble. In an Alabama uniform. First down and 10, Tennessee. Jones in motion. Crompton. Marcel Darius. Seven yard loss, second down, Crompton back. Wants to set up a little pass to the left, which he does. It's Hardesty who is loose and tackled and dropped by Corey Reamer, number 13, with 12.41 to go in that game, which Alabama won convincingly. Handoff left side. Corey Reamer again. Bryce Brown with the carry. Here's the half roll. Great block on Lorenzo Washington. The pass is complete. Arenas with the tackle on Denarius Moore. Big hole. First down, Tennessee. Clock stops as they move the chain. Crompton finds his man. Mark Barron makes the tackle of Luke Stocker. Crompton, pressure from behind. He's got a man open. This is Gerald Jones. Touchdown, Tennessee. Football game, huh? Lincoln. Tennessee, I think. Yes! <laughs> Bootleg Crompton. Being chased, fires. Caught at the 45-yard line by Gerald Jones. Motion. Yeah, the question is, was it the Alabama players causing the motion, or does Tennessee get another five-yard penalty? Before the snap, false start. 65 offense, five-yard penalty, still first down. Blitz, Crompton, good block. It's caught! Luke Stocker, the tight end at the 27-yard line. Second down, five seconds to go. There you go. Four seconds to go. Lincoln for the lead. Blocked again! Cody again! Oh my! Alabama wins! 